entered his name into the NFL draft. Now he's expected to go to the combine later this month. Everyone is waiting to see if Kyler will choose football or baseball. Murray is due to report to Oakland A's spring training next week and might have to give up his $4.6 million signing bonus if he doesn't. A lot of money. We are joined now by Rob Parker. Good to see you. What's happening? Good morning. Good, morning. Good to have you with us. All right, Rob, should Kyler try to play both sports this spring? Now, when I was down at the Super Bowl, I got a chance to meet him okay. and interview him on the Odd Couple with Chris Broussard mm -hmm. and uh, got a good look at him, you know, up close. He's really small. He's really small. Like, I, I was, like, even surprised at how small No, no, Skip. No, no, was. Skip. Really, really small. You, you met him, too, right? I told I saw you. It. Yeah. We see eye to eye. He, no, he, and, and, but but the, here's the thing. I don't have a problem with him in the spring trying to do both, just from this standpoint. First, before the draft, let people know I am still interested in football because if you kind of don't do the combine, then they say, well, this guy's not really. What's he going to do at the combine? Is he just showing up or is he going to participate? Well, but I'm, I'm thinking he's going to participate to I try think, to, okay. right, Skip, to try to get I mean, people I don't know interested. Why he would declare and commit to it. Without... Right, if you're not going to go do that. Okay. All I'm saying is, if you don't do those things, then people go, he's not interested in football. And then if I was maybe thinking about drafting him, I'd say, I don't want to waste a draft pick if he's going to play baseball. If he goes to spring training, what are they going to say then? No, he can, he can go to spring training and at people this point. people say, is he serious about football? But then after, when the draft comes, you know what I mean? And if they dra draft him, then he'll have to make a decision. He can't do both. You can't play quarterback and play Major League Baseball or go to the minor leagues. Not both. Now, if you were a different player, running back, DB, mm -hmm. you know Deion what I mean? Bo Jackson. Yes, you could Brian do it. Brian Jordan was a defensive back that did it for a little while. He did it for a few years, and yeah. then he picked baseball, and he had a good, good career. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I, right now, I understand why he's doing it. I don't think it's a problem to do both. But at some point, he's going to have to. Now, the funny thing was, I had a couple of people listen to the interview. I didn't get this. Hmm. But the people who listened to the interview on Fox Sports Radio, they all said to me, after listening to the, to the interview, I got the feeling he's going to play baseball. I didn't get that myself in talking to him face-to-face -face because he was still guarded. But I had two or three people who are reporters who listened to that who said, it sounds like he's playing baseball. For me, Skip, mm -hmm. look, he likes baseball. He's really good at both. Mm -hmm. He likes baseball, Skip. He loves playing quarterback mm -hmm. and playing football. And as Rob, as you mentioned, if you play in any other position, Skip, he could pull this off. Yep. Mm -hmm. Because it doesn't, it doesn't require the studying time to be great at quarterback like it does at running back. You can't have... Because he's Bo Jackson, I'm going to say, hey, Bo, 18 toss. Mm -hmm. Okay, you go to the left, all right, I'm going to toss you the ball. Right. Or 18 handoff, or 19 handoff. Dion, you got that man. Mm -hmm. That's simple. Yep. Quarterback, Skip, you know to be great the amount of study time that is required. Mm -hmm. So for And how are you going to come in at the – you're going to come in – so let me get this right. You're going to play 162 <laughs> games of baseball, and then you're going to come in what? What, what, seven, eight games left? Because the end of baseball, uh, baseball goes into October, and if you don't make the World Series, so you Right, so the end of the season starts uh, unless you, October 1st. Unless you're doing the minor league season, right. which would end Shorter. around okay. September 1st. Yeah. So, okay, so now you're going to play. Mm -hmm. No, you can't do it, Skip. Mm -hmm. And I just don't, I, I don't, I mean, what? You let, look, you declare for the draft, and you had to do that because if you didn't, you'd have been lost and you'd have to go back to school. Okay, I get it. But you know where your heart is. Mm -hmm. You know the one that you love. You like one. But you love the other. Mm -hmm. I believe play, winning the Heisman and the adulation, Skip, he's going to get more praise and adulation for playing quarterback in the NFL. Mm -hmm. I don't care who you are for baseball. Shannon, but, Shannon, is, is it the size thing that is there a little ounce of doubt, though? You met him. Yeah, wait, wait, I, I didn't wait, meet wait, him, but I saw him. Oh, you saw him. Okay. Yeah. But you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. the, the, the doubt in his mind, one thing to do, and a lot of guys have done it in college football, but then can't transfer over to yeah, mm, right. what well, they yeah, say the, the game is different is, is the space Warren and I know Warren very well Warren says he believes Warren he can be really moves. really good yeah. Warren yes mm -hmm. okay yep well he, he's been quoted as saying that yes. several times obviously Kyler Murray and his father who played college football want to cover their bases they want to hedge their bats they would like to have their cake and eat it too and it's not going to work because the more you try to play both against the middle, it's a lose-lose proposition because of the position he plays in football. I'm going to say it again. 
his college stats in baseball do not scream star. Billy Bean, who I have the utmost respect for and know very well, he's seeing something in him that was worth $4.66 million bet on him. Correct. But again, star, I'm not sure. Football, I'm sure he can play. I don't care how short he is. He can be really, really short, and he's really, really good at football because I saw it in college. He dominated in college. He put up the greatest numbers anyone has ever put up. You can figure out how to win with him in pro football. Unless pro football decides your heart's not in pro football, what are you trying to do? Because look at the schedule he's mapping out for himself. He wants to go to spring training with the big league club on February 15th because Billy's invited him to the big league club. And then he says, oh, wait, I got to go away for a few days for the combine, February 27th to March 2nd. Really? Oh, then he goes back to spring training. He says, I got to go to the Oklahoma Pro Day in Norman, Oklahoma for a couple of days. I'll be gone for a couple of days. No big deal. Then I'll be back. And then all of a sudden, I'm going to start my minor league season on April 4th. But, oh, by the way, at the end of the month, there's this NFL right. draft. And I'm going to have to miss two or three games because I got to go to, to, to the draft. Where is it? Is it Jerry World this year or something? Is it Jerry's? Yeah. yeah right, right. Tennessee. 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 Right. Nashville. 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 What am I saying? Yeah. So he's going to have to take off last, last year. year. Okay. Ooh, so so yeah. he's just, think of this. Again, the baseball people are really not going to like it, and at some point you're going to risk because right now he's, Todd McShay is projecting 13th overall to Miami, and I've already told you, I think the Cardinals will think about it with the first overall, and I guarantee you John Gruden will think about it at number four, and the Giants that have to at least think at six, Jags at seventh, your Broncos at 10th, mm-hmm. and the Bengals at 11th, they'd all be thinking about Kyler Murray if they thought – he was 1,000% invested in football. And, and if he's not, and they're not sure, and they get all the way to draft night, you know what's going to happen. When, when He'll start falling through the first round. He'll fall out of the and, right? and, yeah, but he, and you, you mentioned all those dates. When is he throwing? And how much can you throw? Yeah. Because don't you have to throw in baseball? Yeah. And don't you have to throw in football? So how much are you going to be able to throw? And throwing a baseball is not the same as throwing but, but a football. I, but I also think I, I, your argument is solid. I get it. Only other problem is mo- most of the time nobody has, there's very few people who have this opportunity right. who are good enough. Mm-hmm. So sometimes for a special athlete, you've got to make uh, rece- Concession. concessions, concessions. That's, yeah. you know, and say, I get it. Mm-hmm. This is not regular Joe Blow where they don't yeah. have another option. Mm-hmm. So, that, so all their uh, focus is on you know, one sport or the other. You covered the NFL long enough. Yes. They don't make Since concessions. Since 1987. Okay, so what did they do, Skip Bayless? You either all in here or you all out there. Mm-hmm. And a first-year the quarterback. I, I get it, but if you think you really have something special, and, so and up do? until the draft, now what if he goes through this? I'm just say he says to the A's, okay, thank you, no, thank you, and he's a fourth-round pick. He's not going to be a fourth. No, I'm. Right? I'm okay, Shannon, by the time hyper- you say no, you you better know that you're going to be a first-round pick, right? Yes. Okay. I think so. So that's that's what I'm saying. You got to know. So is he a first round pick? Me, no, for sure. Question. Let, let me ask you a question. I'm asking. Yeah, if he says no, I'm good, and he goes in the fourth round, he can go back to the he can go back to the eight. Right. He can go back to the eight. And guess what? They give him another check for four point six million, yeah. and he can pick right away. And that furthermore, time. I know this is a longer shot. Let's just say he goes high in the draft, and he goes somewhere for two years, and realizes he's not cut out for the right. National Football League. Go back. You're 22 right now. Well, no, you're not 22 until not this even, August. Right? You're yeah. 21, okay? So in two more years, you're going to be 23 at this point. So what? Okay. Can, can you go back and, and play, just play baseball at 23? Yeah. I know you may have to start over and you'd have to go prove yourself. Right. That ain't like he's starting over at 29, Skip. Mm-hmm. He's starting right. over at 23. Yeah. I hadn't thought of it that way. Yeah, he but a bunch of it. guys... Like Brandon Whedon, he went and tried to play uh, Russell Wilson. Russell they Wilson, a lot baseball, of guys, right. right? And then yeah. they said, okay, we can't do this. Let's go try football. Huh. All right. It's, it's definitely interesting. I, I, I didn't get the, the, that he was picking baseball, but I'm telling you, it was interesting to me that people listened to that interview and said, okay, well, I maybe. think he's picking baseball. Yeah. I, I was just stunned by that because I didn't get that at all. Chris didn't get it. And uh, he was very noncommittal in the interview. Was he overwhelmed by the decision in your eyes? Yeah, I think he's just... I think I think you're right. When you win the Heisman and you do what you did, it's so hard to not want to grab hold of that. It just isn't. To ride, Skip, to ride the bus? They I ride, like the, to ride the bus highs. or I could, be flying, I could be flying and staying in the room. Yeah, but there's been a lot of guys who made $300 million who rode a bus in, in the early days of, of playing baseball, yeah. too. I'm just saying, Shannon, I hear you. Yeah. And they made much more money than guys who played the whole career in football. But they, guess what? 
now with the salaries of the way they are now, you mm -hmm. can make two hundred million dollars playing quarterback in the NFL. Mm -hmm. You also could be a, a Tim Tebow in the NFL. Or you could be Tim Tebow at age thirty and make the Mets. You have to oh, make the it. Mets. Oh, I need more time for that Big one. That's just, need need just a T-shirt. Oh. Oh. You just threw that in there, Rob. Right as we yeah. were going to break. Yeah, have a okay. great bobble here tonight. I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. uh, Lonzo Ball is staying in L.A., but will he now be a key player for the Lakers? We'll discuss his future next.